<laughs> okay, well, this is how I've been trying to explain it to other people just outside of the production. I, okay, Bernard, this guy is insane. Okay, he has this table that he has, he stands on, but he doesn't just stand on it. He, he has this like, these like columns, and then he puts a, a, a like another like pillar that rolls then he puts another one on top of that, and then another pillar that rolls, and then he's juggling fire all at the same time. And like when I try to explain that to people, they're like, they don't understand because you can't understand unless you see it. <laughs> because it's so amazing that you, like who thought to do that? I don't know, but, but when you leave and you really, you go home to your regular life and you're going through Publix and getting cereal, it's not as fun because you just left a python, a dove, a guy that's juggling fire, a sword swallower, three magicians, a hooper. What else was there? I mean, I, I really can't even tell you how many things that there were. When you have to escape that world and come back to reality, it's not fun. <laughs> Definitely not fun. <laughs>